In this video, I'm going to show you how you can back up your Google Photos to an external hard drive. This will be a complete tutorial and hopefully if you follow along, you'll actually be able to get your photos backed up to your external hard drive. So what the first step is really, it's to go ahead and plug in your external hard drive and then find your hard drive, right? So plug it in, then go to your folder icon, then go to this PC and find your hard drive. Mine is a Toshiba. Now from here, what I would do is go to new, create a new folder and just call this new folder something like Google Drive or Google Photos Backup. So I'm gonna type here Google Photos Backup. By doing this, I can stay organized and I know where everything is. So we can double click in that folder and here you can see Google Photos Backup. Now let's go back to the web browser and we need to head over to Google Photos. So to do that, go to photos.google.com or just Google search Google Photos. Here you'll see all of your Google Photos now the chances are you've probably got a lot and we actually need to back it up using a different kind of Google service. But just make sure all your photos are here that you want to back up. Once they are, you need to go ahead and go to a Google service called Google Takeout. So head over to google.com, search Google Takeout and then click on the first one. It should then ask you to sign in. Now here we are in Google Takeout. What I need you to do is deselect all of the data and the only data we're going to download is going to be Google Photos. So now we can find photos. You can either scroll down and find it. Or if you click Control F on the keyboard, it will take you to this window. And from here, you can just search for photos. Once you've searched for photos, just click down one time and you should then see Google Photos. This is all you're looking for. Just check that. You should see one out of 54 selected. We can then scroll all the way down and go to the next step. Now it's going to ask you how you want to receive your files. Keep it on the default. Send download link via email. Keep the file type .zip and I will keep the file size 2 gigabyte as well. If you have more than 2 gigabytes worth of files, it will just split it into different folders. But go ahead and then create that export. Now the only annoying thing about this is with Google Takeout, it will take two days before you can actually get your files. But just keep the export here, don't cancel it. And in two days, you can just back it up. So right now it is the 7th of August. We will get our files emailed to us on the 9th of August. Now, when you do get an email, it will look something like this, your account, your data, and you can just go ahead and click download on any of these. They will download then straight to your computer, right? Once you get your files downloaded to your computer, it will look something like this. It will be in a zip file. You just want to then head over to your download. So go to your folder icon, go to downloads. And here you see like some transfer data download file. It will be a zip file, right? You can right click on this file. You can then copy it by going here. And you can do this for as many files as you have. Maybe Google split your data up. Now you just want to go ahead and find your external hard drive. So I'm going to go this PC, we'll go Toshiba and we'll find the folder we created, Google Photos Backup. Now we can paste in that zipped file that we've downloaded from Google into our external hard drive. This could take a while depending on how big it is. You can do this multiple times. Once you've done that, you've essentially backed up your photos and they are on the external hard drive now. I hope that quick video helped you out. Let me know in the comments if you've got any questions.